harder today for a guitar player because uh, everybody's sort of playing the same now. They've got this Inge Malmsteen mixed up with Steve Vai, mixed up with the... Uh, and, and, and I think a lot of kids are getting a little bit tired of some of that too, and they're, they want to go back more to the blues roots rock and roll. You know, I, they certainly tell me that. You know. Today, you see the kids in every music store that play like this. So, I mean, what are they really accomplishing by doing, showing themselves to do these things? Almost anyone can do it. To me, it sounds almost like Nintendo music or something when you hear it. It's just so fast, it's unintelligible. Uh, and, and I like to think of the guitar, well, of any instrument, guitar, drums, horn, kind of like a voice. And uh, I would never, you don't see a whole lot of singers come out and sing at 100 miles an hour. I mean, you wouldn't understand what they were, what, even if they weren't singing words, they were just saying la la la. The amount of kids that tell me now, when we are in the studio or whatever on the road, you know, it's really amazing. I mean, we talk about this all the time. They listen to what we do, and and they see a a newness in it in the same way that it's it's not really. I guess that's what why rock and roll is rock and roll. I mean, look at a band like Aerosmith. They've been around since the same time that we've been around in the early '70s, and they're still a very very big happening band because it's straight rock and roll. Today, if you're a great player, you have to be, but that doesn't get you to be a star anymore, you know? I think the days of, are gone when we'll see the superstar, the Jimi Hendrix superstar, the guy on an instrument that's gonna be a superstar. I think today it's good songs, honest performance, and, uh, and, and doing rock and roll so that the kids feel like they're part of it, not like you're up 100 feet and they're down 100 feet, you know? Donc, à surveiller From the Hip euh, bientôt. Euh, son frère Jim.